What's up guys? We're out here at Daniel's Land. <laughs> um, loading up the kayaks. It's my birthday today. Turned 25, so we're gonna go float the river and have a nice day out. All right, we got four of us loaded up. We look like professionals now, <laughs> kinda. About to take off, 10 miles back and forth to Gilbert. Troll. Bonafide against the heifer height slide? No, mm -hmm. probably not, but it'll be out there. I may be under it. No cold beer for you. Oh sh! Don't can bush me here. Give hey. me a cold one. It's the best birthday ever. All right, Big Red. What do you think? I'm having a blast. Are you? I am. Tell them about it. <laughs> Twenty-five. How does twenty-five feel? 25 feels pretty good actually. I was a little emotional about it, but it's gonna be a good time. Oh, I'm glad I'm not 25. That's Thanks. old as hell. Uh, 50. We got a few miles to go. Pretty. It's been nice. Probably need to hop on the water. We're just kind of chilling here. Yeah, we probably need to hop on and take a hop. But we can do it as fast as we wanted to do the rest of it because the, the water's really moving. We got, I think we have like four or five miles to go, but we could do it in like an hour if we wanted to or less because it's like the water's just super high and we've got a ton of flow. It's hard for me to capture, like I've got drones, I've got a DSLR, the GoPros. I try all these different angles and doing all this different camera techniques, but it's like so hard to truly capture like how awesome everything is out here in the river. It's, it's big, it's powerful, but it's small. There's a lot of times there's nobody out here like right now, it's just like our friends. It's just, uh, it's so beautiful to feel. You've really just gotta be out of here, but I wanna do my best to try and share like share what I see and what I feel and it's just absolutely amazing. We've seen snakes, turtles, I've seen deer. There's just all this different stuff that goes on out here that's so amazing. I guess I'm doing this like I look to my right. Like I remember the majority of this river but you see like this bluff face like the camera just doesn't do it justice how many colors there are and how pretty it actually is. The serenity and the remoteness you know or just a turtle j just, oh, a turtle just fell in the water. It was like right on top of this, uh, right on top of this log right here. And I floated up, I didn't even see it, and it fell in the water. It's just so beautiful what something like that is like, and how much this river has to offer. It's such a hidden gem. People from Colorado and Kansas City are out here, like, talking about how beautiful it is and talking about how they'll be back. That just puts it into perspective. There's so much beautiful stuff out in that area. This river really is, I know a lot of people know about it, it's very popular, but it's still just such a hidden gem. Because otherwise there'd be more people out here on a beautiful Sunday afternoon and the end of April, but we'll be out here much more this summer. I'm not complaining, I'm very happy it is the way it is.